Hello everyone, I am Dr. Sharbani, Senior Consultant Shekhar Eye Hospital. Today I am going to discuss about blindness. Uh, first, I will uh, discuss what is blindness, what are the causes of blindness and how to address these conditions so that proper treatment is possible and blindness can be restored to normal vision. Now coming to what is blindness. According to WHO, blindness is defined as visual acuity less than 3 by 60 on vision chart or a sequel value. To put it in simple words, if a patient is unable to count fingers at a distance of 3 meters in daylight, then it can be termed as blindness. So basically, it is extremely low vision in a patient which is we know uh, and can be defined like this as blindness. Coming to the causes of blindness. Before this, we must know that about 45 million people in the world are suffering from blindness. Four out of five of these people are living in developing countries, including India. What is interesting to know is that 80-25% of the blindness is avoidable. Now, by avoidable blindness, we mean preventable and curable blindness. Preventable blindness is are those uh, cases where uh, the development of these conditions can be prevented by effective measures and curable blindness are those like where the already the blindness has happened and we can treat it effectively with the help of uh, certain surgeries or medicines or by both. So, uh, what are the causes of blindness in India? The common causes are number one, cataract. So, cataract is a major cause of blindness in developing countries like India. Uh, this is very important to note that uh, cataract is very uh, visually uh, debilitating condition and this can be restored to normal vision or almost normal vision by a good cataract surgery with IOL implantation. With the advancement of modern technology, cataract surgery by paper emulsification and minimally invasive surgery has become totally painless, injection free and a daycare procedure wherein the patient can come in the morning and get discharged within a few hours uh, on the same day. Also, it is a minimally invasive procedure. It means that it does not require any uh, stitches to be put in the eye and hence the recovery period is also very fast. So, uh, coming to the other causes like refractive weather. So, this is a very common cause in young population that they are having refractive errors, which is a number commonly we say that the patient has minus number or plus number and he requires glasses. So, if we use glasses properly at the right time in young patients, then vision can be restored to almost normal. Coming to the other causes is glaucoma. Glaucoma, as we know, is a, a condition where there is irreversible vision loss. So, this is very important to detect glaucoma at a very early stage. If we can detect it at an early stage, later then we can use the proper treatment like with the help of lasers or surgery as required and prevent the irreversible nerve damage in glaucoma. Coming to the diabetic complications, diabetic retinopathy is also a major cause of blindness. So we can prevent this by detection of diabetic retinopathy in patients at an early stage and we can treat it accordingly with the help of lasers, injections or surgery as is required and prevent irreversible vision loss. So it's very important for any patient who is diabetic to undergo a proper retina checkup at least once in a year or maybe sometimes if needed uh, in six months so that any diabetic retinopathy changes can be detected early and treated accordingly. Coming to causes of uh, blindness in childhood, that is childhood blindness, uh, corneal opacities can happen due to different infections like measles, ophthalmia and neuroterum and vitamin A deficiency. So it's very important to treat these conditions and also prevent these conditions by effective measures like in vitamin A deficiency, we can prevent it by proper administration of vitamin A in children so that these conditions can be avoided. Childhood infections need to be treated early and prompt measures have to be taken so that the childhood blindness and childhood corneal opacities can be prevented uh, early. Coming to other causes like trauma injuries, 
uh, of course care should be taken proper precautions should be taken during different festivals when there is a uh, chance of injury to the eye so that visual deterioration of visual impairment or blindness can be prevented from injuries and trauma also if trauma happens injury happens early uh, uh, consultation with an eye specialist and proper treatment should be done so that we can prevent any kind of vision loss in these patients so the take home message for blindness should be that 80% of blindness is avoidable the causes of blindness vary according to the population the age group in elderly population of course cataract is a major cause and which can be treated with the advanced technology in a painless uh, manner and with uh, minimally invasive procedures with eye implantation uh, the refractive error in young population minus or plus number is a common cause which can be treated with glasses childhood blindness can be treated with the help of a proper effective measures like vitamin a and uh, proper uh, child uh, infections should be treated at an early stage so that corneal opacities don't develop in children other causes like glaucoma diabetic retina complications these also have to be detected early uh, whenever a patient is diabetic whenever there is a family history of glaucoma we should uh, not wait and go to the eye specialist and get a checkup done so that glaucoma and diabetic retinopathy are detected at an early stage and proper measures can be taken so that vision loss and blindness can be prevented and if there is vision impairment we can at least improve the vision to some extent so uh, that is very important for any patient with low vision to come to the red, uh, eye specialist and get a proper checkup done so that we can help the patients to see better and much uh, in a much more you know uh, if not always a normal vision is possible then at least the visual impairment is improved the visual rehabilitation is possible thank you